Hi, and welcome to AUEagles.com postgame wrap-up. I'm Adam Shackett, joined here by Will Miller as the AU Eagles just defeated the Holy Cross Crusaders by a score of 84-53. to It was really a dominating performance today by the Eagles, and they got a lot of all-around performances, especially by Lisa Shack and Ashley Yencho. Lisa Shack led the way with 18 points, and Ashley Yencho scored 10 for the Eagles. It was really important for the Eagles to come out today after a tough loss against the Army and have a dominating start to begin the game. Now here's what Coach Corkery and some of the players had to say about the start of the game. When we look back at the Army game, we really felt like we didn't play very hard, you know, and just uh, from a hustle standpoint, effort standpoint, we really got, you know, outworked in that game, and we take that personally, you know, if that ever happens. And so we really challenged our players over the course of two days, uh, Thursday and Friday, preparing for this game that they've – We've got to play harder, We've got to be more physical, we got to be better on the boards, you know, we have to play more to our identity as a team. And so it was good to see that we did that, really not just in spurts, but I thought we did it fairly consistently for the most of the game, so uh, that was nice. The Army loss was a really tough one, and we knew coming into practice that it was over with. We had to forget about it, and we had to focus on Holy Cross. And we keyed in, and we wanted to make a statement in this game to let everyone we're not going away. And Coach Corkery really stressed on how important this victory was today, especially moving on to Wednesday's matchup against the Navy. Well, I think it helps us, um, you know, helps us feel good about what direction we're heading after, you know, the Army game. We talked about, you know, we got to, when you get knocked down, you need to bounce, you know, rather than just laying there and rolling around. You have to try to turn it into a positive and use it as motivation. You know, Navy's another team that shoots the three really, really well. They're going to spread the floor a lot like um, Holy Cross does. Um, they'll be a big challenge. Um, but, you know, obviously we feel good about, you know, getting a little bit of momentum today, and, uh, and then we'll start getting ready on Monday for Navy. Well, a lot of the competition is at the same level, but we know that we've really got to pick it up, especially coming up with Navy on Wednesday. Um, I don't know if they're still undefeated, but they were 4-0. So they're at the top of the league right now, and we really just need to get after them as soon as possible on Wednesday and um, make sure that everyone knows that we belong at the top. A big part for AU's success today when they scored the team season high 84 points was the depth of their team and how many players contributed today. They had 36 points from off the bench, and both player and coach talked about how valuable that is for this AU team. We had 19 assists and 11 turnovers, so that's a great, it's really a great ratio right there. But... Um, we've got a lot of good shooters in that in that group. If you look at our ones and twos, you know, with uh, Lex, uh, Yencho, Nicole, Tasia, you know, that group does a really good job of just running our team on the floor and providing leadership, making sure that we're all on the same page, getting the ball where it needs to be. You know, really our energy starts with that group and our unselfishness starts with kind of those positions. Uh, they've got to give the ball up, and and I think that. Um, is a good example for everybody else. Well, I think it's really great that we finally got to kind of exploit all the types of players that we have. I mean, we just had great contributions all over, and it was really great to see, you know, how well we all worked together, and when we had subs in the game, nothing slowed down. It was all, it all flowed really well, and it was just a fun game. And that's another edition of AUEagles.com post-game wrap-up. I'm Adam Shackett, joined here by Will Miller, and we'll be back Wednesday. Thank you.